Ever found yourself pondering where all the stuff that goes into a black hole ends up? Think of black holes as the ultimate space mystery, a riddle wrapped in an enigma, shrouded by cosmic shadows. They're the ultimate dare to the curious mind, daring us to unravel their secrets. Black holes are often depicted as cosmic vacuums, relentlessly sucking up everything in their vicinity. You might envision them as celestial hoovers, gobbling up stars, gas, dust, and the occasional unwary spacecraft. But this image, while dramatic, doesn't quite hit the mark. In reality, black holes are regions of space where gravity has gone rogue. The gravitational pull is so strong that absolutely nothing can escape. This includes particles, electromagnetic radiation, and yes, even light itself. They're like the universe's version of a one-way street where all roads lead in, but none lead out. Now you may wonder, how can something be so powerful? Well, a black hole is formed when a massive star collapses under its own gravity. This collapse results in a tiny region of space with a gravitational pull so intense that it warps and twists the fabric of space-time itself. It's a bit like a cosmic whirlpool sucking everything into its inescapable grasp. But it's not all doom and gloom. Black holes offer a tantalizing glimpse into the unknown. They're at the forefront of our quest to understand the universe and its rules. They challenge our comprehension of what's possible, pushing the boundaries of our knowledge and understanding. They're a testament to the unfathomable complexity and grandeur of the cosmos. Even though black holes are often feared, they're also deeply fascinating. They're like the universe's wild card, a joker in the cosmic deck. They're a stark reminder that the universe is filled with uncertainties and mysteries waiting to be solved. So, as we delve deeper into the world of black holes, remember this. Black holes, though terrifying, are fascinating celestial bodies that challenge our understanding of the universe. Imagine standing on the edge of a precipice one step away from falling into the unknown. That's what the event horizon of a black hole is like. The event horizon, in essence, represents the boundary of a black hole, a point of no return. It's like the ultimate cosmic boundary line, an invisible sphere around a black hole, where the gravitational pull becomes so strong, escape becomes impossible. Anything that dares to cross this boundary, be it light or matter, will inevitably fall into the black hole, never to return. This is why black holes appear black as not even light, the fastest thing in our universe, can break free from this gravitational prison. The event horizon is a region where our understanding of physics is challenged and where reality as we know it warps and twists. The event horizon is the final frontier, beyond which lies the enigmatic heart of a black hole. What occurs when matter crosses the event horizon and plunges into a black hole? Well, let's try to decipher this cosmic enigma together. The first thing you might imagine is utter destruction, and you wouldn't be wrong. But the manner of this obliteration is far more fascinating than you might think. Picture yourself falling into a black hole. As you move closer, the pull of gravity becomes stronger at your feet than at your head. This difference creates a stretching effect and you'd start to elongate, just like spaghetti. This process, aptly named spaghettification, is one of the bizarre phenomena that could occur inside a black hole. Now you might be thinking, all right, I've been turned into a cosmic noodle. What's next? Well, according to some theories, you'd be compressed into an almost infinitely small point. This is due to the colossal gravitational pull inside a black hole, which could squish even the most robust of objects into a tiny speck. But here's where things get really weird. Some physicists propose that black holes might be gateways to other universes or dimensions. It's a radical idea, but not entirely baseless. You see, 
the laws of physics as we know them, break down inside a black hole. So it's entirely possible that once you cross the event horizon, you're entering a realm where different rules apply. And finally, there's the idea of a firewall, a theoretical wall of high-energy particles that would incinerate anything that dares to venture into a black hole. This concept was proposed as a possible solution to the so-called black hole information paradox, a puzzling question about what happens to the information about the physical state of things that fall into a black hole. Though these theories are intriguing, remember, they are just that, theories. The inside of a black hole remains a mystery. And perhaps that's just as well. After all, some secrets of the universe might be best left unexplored. At the heart of the black hole lies an enigma, the singularity. A point where mass is thought to be infinitely dense, confined within an infinitesimally small space. It's as if the universe has crumpled a piece of matter into an unimaginably tiny dot. This is the singularity, an area where the gravitational pull is so strong, it warps and contorts space and time into a single point. It's a bit like crumpling a sheet of paper into a ball. The surface is still there, but it's been compressed into a form that's unrecognizable. But here's the thing. When we talk about infinities in physics, it usually means that our understanding of the universe has hit a roadblock. In the case of the singularity, the laws of physics as we know them just don't apply. It's a zone where the familiar physical constants no longer hold true and where our mathematical models break down. It's like trying to divide by zero on your calculator. The result is undefined. In the same way, our current theories, including Einstein's theory of general relativity, fail to define what happens at the singularity. So we're left with a paradox. A black hole is both incredibly simple, described by just three properties, mass, charge and spin, and yet at its heart it harbors the most complex and least understood regions in the universe. The singularity is where our understanding breaks down, and new physics might be needed to fully understand it. So, where does all the stuff that falls into a black hole actually go? That's the million dollar question, isn't it? There are a few theories to tackle this cosmic conundrum. One theory suggests that black holes might be connected to white holes. If you're wondering what a white hole is, it's basically the opposite of a black hole. While black holes pull everything in, white holes are said to eject matter out. So in theory, anything that falls into a black hole might come out through a white hole somewhere else in the universe. Sounds like a cosmic recycling plant, doesn't it? But hold your horses, we're not done yet. There's another theory that suggests matter doesn't really disappear into the black hole. Instead, it gets plastered across the black hole's event horizon, kind of like a cosmic billboard, storing all the information about the stuff that fell in. It's a bit like you being turned into a detailed painting on the wall of a black hole. There's a third proposition, known as the holographic principle, suggesting everything inside a black hole is actually encoded on its surface, again at the event horizon. This theory treats the event horizon like a boundary, preserving the information about everything that's fallen in. But before you start betting on any of these theories, remember, they're just that. Theories. We don't have any concrete evidence to back them up yet. And that's what makes black holes so fascinating and frustrating at the same time. They're these cosmic mysteries that we're still trying to unravel. Until we can get closer to a black hole, or develop new physics, the question of where stuff goes remains unanswered. So for now, we're left with theories, speculations, and a universe that just keeps getting more and more intriguing. But isn't that the beauty of exploring the cosmos? The more we know, the more we realize how much there is left to discover. Black holes continue to be one of the universe's greatest mysteries. 
an apt statement to begin this concluding scene as we've journeyed through the enigmatic depths of black holes, a journey that's left us with more questions than answers. We've traversed the event horizon, the point of no return, where light itself surrenders to the insatiable pull of the black hole. We've peered into the unfathomable innards of these celestial beasts, where the laws of physics as we know them crumble and give way to the unknown. We've grappled with the concept of singularity, a point of infinite density at the heart of a black hole, where space-time curves infinitely, confounding our understanding of reality. And we've pondered the ultimate question, where does all the stuff that gets sucked into a black hole actually go? Through it all, one thing is abundantly clear. Black holes are not just fascinating, they are a testament to the endless wonders and complexities of our universe. They challenge our understanding, push the boundaries of our knowledge, and invite us to delve deeper, to question more, to never stop learning and exploring. So, let's keep seeking, let's keep questioning, let's continue to be awed by the mysteries of the cosmos. Because as we continue to explore the cosmos, who knows what new secrets black holes will reveal.